one, Flores Command. You are clear to begin descent to surface. Copy. Disengaging. Initiating auxiliary thrusters. Command, we are 20 seconds to atmosphere breach. Initiate burn. Rotate and break. Primary ignition set to 30%. Rotating. We are engine first. Altitude 20,000 feet and falling. Mode one. We are getting interference. Switch to high gain antenna. Command, confirm signal strength. You're looking great, Pod 1. Go for landing. Engines off. Pod 1 has landed. Almost looks like home. That's what worries me. Well, boss. You ready? Got my truck. I want snipers at three and six, multiple defense lines, and an operating base established within the hour. Move! Goodman, a word. You know the stakes of this mission. Flores is already half dismantled. Our engine's on its way down to power a city of half a million. Now, if these outrider bozos hit pay dirt, you report to me first. Sir, I'm only here to answer a proper procedure this fall. We're not on Earth, Shearer. There is no proper procedure. Listen up, outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. But the ECA pencil heads can't green like this land until we find their missing probes. So let's do our job! ECA HQ to Outrider Alpha. Do you copy? This is Alpha Actual. Damn atmospherics are messing with the radar. Can't get a lock on the probes. Negative HQ. Our systems are all functioning. We'll set up camp further up. We're looking to camp for further instructions. HQ, can you repeat? I'm gonna scout ahead on foot. Need to stretch my damn legs. I'll take point. Don't need to see you get eaten on day one. Relax, Outrider. You don't owe me anything. Cap. I wouldn't be here without you. I'd be buried in the ashes back home. <laughs> All right. Let's move out. Stay sharp. Watch our sixes. Hey. No matter what happens out here, I need my best gun on this in case things go south. Can I depend on you? Just tell me what to do, Cap. My weapons haven't been fired in nearly a century. Why don't you head over to Jacob and get your gear checked, and then be prepared to move out as soon as those probes are located. Any questions? No word from Earth, I assume? It's really gone? She went dark 15 years into our journey. More or less as predicted. ECA's confirmed no communication since. Oh, shit. You know, I uh, grew up a slum dog, fighting for scraps. Lost everyone, really, long before the end. Doomsday just wasn't a thing I worried about. Hell, I wasn't going to live past 20 anyway. Somehow, I was one of the ones who made it. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here. As things go right, time's coming, you're gonna have to leave all that behind. This is a new beginning. You could have a family here, build a cabin, grow old and get fat. Yeah, that's not me, Cap. Know my way around bullets, not kids. There's gonna be no need for someone like me here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. 
But you're one of the chosen few. You get to build the future. Don't waste it. Did any more of your people make it off Earth, Cap? My brother. Almost. But no. They got him in cryo as we evacuated L.A. Hoping we could stop the bleeding. But he was too far gone. Ah, oh, shit. Sorry to hear that. I haven't had the time to think about it. What about Sarah? She's good, right? Yeah. My Sarah's up there. They don't wake her group for another six months, but I can wait. I'm, uh... I didn't have a chance to tell you this and all the madness, but... My little girl's pregnant. That's how I got her the seat. <laughs> it's a two-for-one special, huh? So that's why you've been in such a good mood since they unfroze your ass. Don't push it out, right? <laughs> yes, sir, granddad, sir. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert. What's on your mind, boss? I know that look you get. That last day got really hairy. I wasn't sure if any of us were gonna make it. We cut it pretty close. You can't stop thinking about it either. I know. It's insane. It was 80 years ago. Yeah, it feels like days. My knuckles are still sore, my ears still ringing from all the gunfire. I mean, there were thousands of them, all climbing over each other, slaughtering everyone in their way, and tried to pull down the launch tower to bash in the doors of our shuttles. I've been in a lot of war zones, but that was fucking anarchy. Look, it was either us getting off the planet or them, but we just did what we had to do. We do what we have to do. We look out for each other. Hell, we better. Other than the Captain Cuspert, you're the only person left alive I know. I'm the only person left alive worth knowing. <laughs> I'm glad you made it on board, you old bastard. Me too. What do you make of this place, Jakob? It's perfect. Beautiful. How long you want to bet before we bury it all under concrete and plastic? Oh, come on. You can't still be that cynical. Just look at this valley. I don't know, boss. Maybe we all just got too much riding on this. We already have one dead planet in the rear view. If we screw this one up too, it... Maybe we won't. Sure. Maybe this is really it. Maybe we can finally stop sleeping with our guns under our pillows, stop worrying about food every goddamn day. Believe me, boss. I want this to work. You have no idea. Mads. Huh? People don't change. Still got your money on black, huh? Uh, the house always wins. Oh my gosh. This is stunning. I wish you could have seen this, Dad. Hey. You're Shira, right? Huh. I'm sorry. Can you believe this landscape? So beautiful. Now, if only we had an internet to post those two. It's for a scientific record. <laughs> Besides, we'll have the internet up and running in the first six months. The entire thing is backed up. I'm just pulling your legs, Shira. Any luck with the probe? The scan's still running. I don't know what else I can do, it's just... How can the probe signals have simply vanished? Yeah, they said it was some kind of interference or something? Ah, from space, maybe, but not from down here. Still, seems initial readings were right. We're breathing. Yes, but before the ECA can authorize half a million more people coming here, we need the probe's data to know we can support them. And if we can't? What's the ECA's plan B? Do you have any questions I got answers to? How is this colonization gonna work? You're in the planning rooms, right? Yes. We've already started disassembling the engine. We need to bring that down first. 
The nuclear core should give us enough power to get the colony up and running. And when do the civilian pods start coming down? Within a few weeks, if all goes well. First, just enough people and resources to get our infrastructure running. You know, water, food, and shelter. Then we'll keep waking folks from cryo, a few thousand at a time, no more than we can feed. Until before you know it, you'll be standing in the middle of a city. And meanwhile, the flora stays up there? The ship was built in orbit. It was never meant to land. We'll have to keep it in our skies until we're capable of space flight again. One day, maybe. All right, tell me the truth. You think the ECA thought this whole plan through? Well, my father was part of the team that designed the plan. My entire life he helped prepare for this day. The greatest undertaking of human history. Oh, so that's how you got on the ship, huh? Daddy smoothed your way? No. I studied engineering. Spent years in orbit. Designed structure, drilling rivets into the hull. I helped build that ship. So you earned your way on. Good for you. It was my father. Just not like the way you thought. He gave up his place for me. He stayed behind. Shit, I'm, uh... Sorry. He would have been in all of this place. But in the end, it's just me. It's strange not knowing anyone here. When this is over, come hang out with us. We're not such a bad bunch. I might take you up on that. Hey, is that supposed to blink that way? Oh, 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 that's a probe. Tanner, I think we got a signal, it's close. Excellent work, Outrider. Now go locate the damn thing, so we can land this beauty. Copy that. Hey, it's an historic moment. We should document it. For the scientific record, huh? Hey, Cuthbert, any updates? The probe signal is mostly noise, but I've tracked its source. There. Hope you all brought your galoshes. Ooh. Jakob, mm. same shit, different planet. Ochevishcha. <laughs> Electronics are freezing up. Trucks are down. We continue on foot. Soldier, your primary focus is Shira. Understand? We keep moving. Eyes up. Choke on your own spit, dude. It's nothing, I'm good. <coughs> Jesus. Shit! Oh, back to the ship! <coughs> Alert the medics! What's going on? Hey, stay back! Get a medic to the uh, perimeter. God damn it. Tanner, got eyes on the probe. I got movement, heading in. <sighs> 
Tanner, I found it. Good work. Get the drive, so get the hell out. Wait, hold on. This thing's just in relay mode. Tanner, the signal isn't coming from the probe. It's coming from outside our search zone, somewhere else on the planet. That's impossible. There is nobody else. Secure the hard drive. We'll analyze that signal back at base. Copy. Ugh! Damn it! Something's frying it, Tanner. Give us the frequency. Uh, carrier frequency is nine, seven, point. Uh, Tanner, do you copy? Oh, shit. Tanner, Tanner, I'm seeing some really strange shit down here. What the fuck? I need quarantine set up at base. Do you copy? <laughs> Shit. Maxwell, what the fuck is all this? What does it look like? Sergeant Major, sir, we have to follow quarantine procedure and hold the landing. Whatever the original reports about this planet, they were wrong. There's some kind of anomaly. If we land now, everyone will die. There's no holding the landing. It's too late for that. Oh. There's nowhere else to go. Oh. 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 <laughs> Tanner here! We need help! <laughs> we need medics! See to them! Hurry! No, stop. They're contaminated. <laughs> We contain them. That's an order. You always were an asshole. Look around you. We got men and women in need of medical attention. Now get your asses in gear and do the right thing, or I'm gonna have to fuck it. No! Contain this. Now. Burn the fucking bodies. Do the right thing. Call it in! Postpone the fucking landing! It's too late! Hey, and you! And you! Help me with the wounded. We have to get them to Metla. Over here! Come on, move your asses! Get them at the 
We're yeah. almost there. Uh, you're gonna be fine. What are you doing? I'm putting you back into cryo until Medlab can save your fucking life. Don't be ridiculous, I'm done for. Uh, Pep talks aren't really my thing. When is something truly over? Was it when your people left Earth behind? Was it when you watched the first spaceship crash and burn? Was it when you saw your fellow Outriders crumble at your feet? Was it watching yourself die? But Enoch isn't done with you yet, Outrider. Like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. your pod. Where were the uplink nodes? Uh, come on, Doc. We need to go. They're coming. Wait, we can't just leave them here. These are outriders. They're not why we're here. I'm sorry. Find out! The anomaly is coming. Let's see how fast you can run! The no man's land! Like the others! ECA too, right? When we get to no man's land, we gotta stick together if we wanna survive. Survive what? Getting our asses fried by the big storm! Hey, I told you two to shut the hell up! We're here! Come on! Go back! Go back! What the hell's happening? They've got an altar that's tearing our guys apart! You need to get out of here! To where? Storm's coming! You think the altar care about a storm? Uh, shit, shit, shit! Uh, Take the back way through the bridge! But we're not gonna make it! Let's just toss him out of here and get to cover! And Rob, the captain of the show, are you out of your gun? Watch out! No! I can't see! Help me! Help! Help! What's she doing? Leave me alone! Help! Your man was wounded! That's better that way! Don't struggle! Go, go, go! How long? How long has it been? What? This, this war? How fucking long? Who knows? Since before I was born! That's fucking impossible! Come on, open the goddamn gate! And move! Hold tight, almost there! Almost where? Where are you taking us? I'm not supposed to be- What the hell is the matter with you? You just wake up or something? Cryo, I just- Well, let me catch you up real quick. That paradise you Outriders promised us, guess what we've got instead? Goddamn alien storms! No shelter, no food, just kicked to the curb like exiles while your ECA pals got fat in their bunker! Bullshit! It wasn't like that! We lost electronics! We could have left you all the rot in your cryopods! But we didn't! We saved you ungrateful fuck! How many times did I tell you to shut up? 
Gates open! Better hold your breath! Welcome to the Valley of Death, asshole! Your stink of Enoch. Your kind are abominations. Exile. Who the hell are you? Outrider. Impossible. Such untapped power. Such confusion. You want answers. Whatever you were before, you're something new now. A second life. Don't waste it. Who... Who was that? Lord Zeth? He's... He's altered. And he's a little man. A little man. Altered? What the fuck does that mean? You... <laughs> you don't know what you are. <laughs> Where'd you steal that uniform? I didn't. It's mine. Yeah? If you's really an outrider, then you fight's in the wrong side, Haltered. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Grand Marshal, she'll explain. Come. Where is she? There. There. What is that? Uh, go, go, go. Do whatever you have to do, Lieutenant. Shira? You're alive. I'm sorry to disappoint you. You came from their side. You got any intel for us? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, I got a war to win, so either you help me or you get back into cryo. Hold on. I've just woken up to mud and shit. I've been asleep for God knows how many years. 31 years. So for 31 years, I've been seeing people fight and die while you were getting comfy in cryo. So excuse me for not throwing you a little welcome party. What happened to you? The anomaly! 
That's what happened. You mean that storm? We told them not to land. Anything more advanced than a grease engine got fried. All our data wiped out. We couldn't grow crops or make medicine. So we ended up in the same place as when we left Earth. Just killing each other over the little we have left. Why didn't you go somewhere else? The Outriders could have- The Outriders are dead. What? And the anomaly keeps us in this fucking valley. We can't go anywhere else. You don't get it, do you? You think you're dreaming? This is real. Believe me, it's fucking real. So whether you like it or not, you're stuck here in the mud and shit like the rest of us. You should have never woken up. Warden, miss out on all this? Grand Marshal, we were too late. The hounds have him. He's been taken underground. Well, get him back. Well, it may be our side, but that's not our turf, ma'am. I'm not losing people over Yakub. Yakub? He's still alive? Not too much longer, it seems. Then I'll go find him. Ma'am? Ma'am? Never mind. We've got it covered. I'm looking for Jakub Dubrowski. Go away. Listen, asshole. You got a gun pointed right at your... Ah! 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 Nice eyes. Hey! Whoa. Oh, sorry, guys. I thought this was the bathroom. Ah! 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 You okay? I had it under control. Been a while. Do I know you? <laughs> Kurva! Then I thought you were dead. You'll soon be dead if you don't get your ass to Shira's right now. Uh, Shira. All right. Come meet me there when you're ready. No, because he won't. Because he can do what the fuck he wants. <sighs> hey, never been so happy to see a familiar face. You haven't aged a day. And you got old, my friend. In the hallway, that was Seth. What was he doing here? Ignoring our pleas for help. I thought he was on your side. <laughs> <laughs> Seth, he's not on anyone's side. The insurgents have altered their walking nightmares. We're lucky Seth shows up to fight them back sometimes, but only if it fits whatever the hell game he's playing. Hey, damn it. What are you... you have no idea how bad it is, Outrider. We thought we escaped the apocalypse. We thought we could start over again here. But we were wrong. I was wrong. Shira. Do you know why I'm in charge? Because I'm the only officer left alive. The insurgents at our door, they're feral, sadistic. They have us surrounded. We're low on food and bullets. And if those freaks don't kill us, this planet will. Welcome back. The black fungus in the forest. We never found a cure. The mountains are filled with abominations. And the anomaly storms get bigger every year. We don't have much time left. If we don't find a way out of this valley, if we don't find a miracle, this last shred of humanity is over. Shira! Well, would you look at that? I can do things now. I don't understand, but maybe there's a reason. Yes, you are. I guess I know why I saved your damn life all those years ago. I'm sure this isn't exactly what you had in mind. I'm not complaining. Still, I don't get it. The day we landed, that 
storm. It tore Cuthbert apart, but not me. Why? Why was I... Altered? Who the hell knows? When those storms hit, some get ripped inside out, some turn pink polka dot, and a few come back. Fucking immortal. Nothing about the anomaly makes sense. It disrupts the laws of nature. It mutates whatever it touches. Early on, the ECA's best scientists tried to understand the storms, to tame them. None survived. I guess you got lucky, boss. <laughs> or maybe not. All I care about is that you are on our side. Our only supply line is blocked by an altar that our weapons cannot touch. Out by the old solar array. Seth had no interest in helping us, but now, you're here. Hmm. Hell, why not? Maybe I can buy humanity another day. <gasps> Lieutenant, what the hell was that? The whole front line just collapsed! Like an earthquake, or I, I, I think we lost our whole first line of defenses! On my way. Go, go, go! Hey, in case I don't get another chance, I, I tried to find you, but it all went to shit. We had to run for our lives. I just... Forget it. I'm alive. I should have been dead ten times over, if not for Tanner, if not for Shira. I'm the one with dues to pay now, Jakob. Boss, I missed you. It's good to have you back. Now go beat that altar's ass for us. So we can get back in this goddamn fight. And so, Outrider, you've had your first kill. We Alter do not die so easily, do we? Seth. Come. We must speak. They asked you to help them. To fight the altar down there. Why didn't you? That pathetic monstrosity was a distraction. People are dying because of him. Without the supply route open... They all die. These feeble creatures. Slaughtering each other over scraps. You waste your gifts. Running errands for them. Trying to win their meaningless, endless war. You must realize... You are not like them anymore. So what? I should play at being a god like you? I am not playing. But you are something even more. Altered and Outrider. The last Outrider. Do what you were sent here for. Go beyond the frontier. These people need their gods. Only one like you could lead them to a future. Why not you? They call him Moloch. Oh. I fight another war, far above this petty squalor. My war is with the worst of our kind. This one is too powerful. He will destroy us all, unless I hunt him down. But this is not your fight. You are to be the shepherd. Find a way for them out of this slaughter. Outrider. <laughs> 
Shira, it's done. Your supply line's open, I'm heading home. I know you have a million questions, but I don't have time. You let me sleep in a few too many fucking years. I think you can find some time. How did it all begin? Why'd you start fighting? When the anomaly got bad, we had only just begun the colonization. There were still more than half a million frozen in cryo waiting for us to wake them. But we already knew we couldn't feed them all. So one faction argued to just pull the power and let them die in their sleep, preserve the resources we had. The others wanted to give them a chance to live. I can guess which side you were on. I was... I was wrong. We tried to be fair and to ration what we had. But it only led to bloodshed. Your enemy. What do they want? What do any of us want? To have enough. But there isn't. Enough food, enough water, anything. They won't settle until they have all we have. They want to destroy us. So I need to destroy them first. What am I now? Altered? Help me understand. What do you want to know? How many are there? There are lesser ones all over with small and strange mutations. But those with true power, only a handful. Still more than I'm comfortable with. But the soldiers revere them as gods. The other altered out there, who do they fight for? Whoever the fuck they want, you think anyone controls them? The ones who fight with us, they at least seem to have a reason for it. Some shred of humanity still. But on the other side, they're demonic, wrathful gods, machines of death. There's nothing human left. That won't happen to me. I pray that's true. This is insane. I watched you take this photo a few hours ago. That was a lifetime ago. That girl you met that day is long gone. That girl could never have survived. <sighs> Take it. I don't need it anymore. You've been gone too long to understand how truly fucked we are. There can be more than 50 or 60,000 of us left. More on the other side than ours. Soon there'll be none of us left to fight. The insurgents' last assault was a distraction. They were digging tunnels and planting charges right beneath us. They blew our front line all to hell. I noticed. The reports of casualties are uncountable. And one of my best men was out there, Lieutenant McCain. But a message just got through. And he's trapped under the rubble, still alive. I don't have any more men to spare. I need you to get him out. It's the least I can do. <clears throat> Why did it just get so quiet? Hey, Shira, what am I looking at? Some kind of walking giant out here. Keep your voice down, Ryder. You don't want it to notice you, believe me. It can wipe out hundreds in a second. Even the altered respect them. Coast is clear! Keep digging, we're almost out! <sighs> 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 
passenger. Hold on, I got you. Wait! Wait! Don't shoot! We're all in this together right now. I got you! Lieutenant McCain? You all right? I'm alive. Thank you, soldier. It's okay. Now, let's get the rest of my men out. Fuck, seriously? War is war. What, you think we just hug it? Why do I even bother? I'm pretty busy right now. What do you need? Your lieutenant's dead. Tell me he died like a hero. <laughs> sure, if that's what you want to hear. He was a real fucking hero. Whatever he did, know that this is war, Outrider. All must be forgiven. Until we win. Are you so sure it's even worth winning anymore? Altered. You're too late. What happened here? What does it fucking look like? We got mutilated. We had the bastards cornered, but... They had a captain. Oh. A captain? Yeah, you know, the fuckers with powers who get put in charge. <laughs> not a real altered. Not like we could notice a difference. What's he look like, this captain? Scar down his face. Sadistic fuck. Oh. He forced half my squad to walk into an anomaly, and he enjoyed it. Yeah, I think I know the guy. Where is he? Inside the bunker up the hill. I wish I could look him in the eyes when you make him pay for what he did. I think I'll pay him a little visit. For old time's sake. Wait! Stop! You're unaltered. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Where the fuck are you fighting for those, those fascist assholes? We're the ones fighting for our lives. Do you even know what they did to us? I know what you did to me. He paid. Not enough. You gonna be okay? You need a medic or something? You nuts. A medic round here will kill me faster than the shrapnel will. Don't worry about me. I'll live to fight another day. Well, all right. <sighs> hey! You did a good thing. I don't believe you. Hey, Dupek. Jakob. Shira. The signal in the forest. You remember it? Yeah, like it was yesterday. You still have its frequency, don't you? You mean this frequency? Curva. You got the winning lotto numbers tattooed on your ass cheek, too? Still don't believe me? Ugh, I hate when you play the I told you so. That signal is still playing like a distant echo. It's digital, which means it must be coming from a place where there is no anomaly. The problem is, we've never been able to locate its source because we've never had the right frequency. Until you showed up. So now, listen close, you need to bring those precise numbers to Dr. Abraham Zahidi, one of our last scientists. Bullshit. He's been deep in enemy territory for weeks now. Five rations says Zahidi's dead. We don't know that. You. I've seen you before. It was... in the med lab. You woke me out of cryo. 
Guess life's real funny that way. Meet Jane. Sniper, first class. She almost died trying to save his life. She'll guide you. Wait, Shira. W when we landed, that signal was already playing. Do you have any idea who or what is sending it? Do yourself a favor. Don't ask that question. Whatever's out there, they don't want to be found. And whoever goes looking for that fucking signal ends up dead. But it's the only chance we've got. And if anyone can get there alive, it's all of you. Shira, come on. Jakob! I that's in order. Sorry I left you to die in that med lab. Hey, no worries. Didn't really have a choice. <laughs> I'd have done the same. And again, Dobrowski has outdone himself. Whoa. <laughs> You've managed to keep my truck working after all these years? Well, I had to strip the AI systems, bypass the graphene cells, cost me 20 bottles of vodka and parts, but now our baby will run on anything. Diesel, turpentine, even fucking potatoes, if we could grow potatoes. You still got tunes? Tunes? Hey boss, we got no electronics. No tunes, no nothing. But somehow we make do. Okay, I tracked the dock to that radio tower on the hill. But the slums between here and there are infested with snaggletooth fucks and enough patrolling insurgents that those mutated things are out hunting. Wait, what kind of mutated things are we talking about? I'll stick to the roofs, give you some eyes from above. Good luck. Get back! I'll kill him! Calm down! Not a step closer, I swear! I'll rip him open! Get back! This man's gonna bleed out. Who are you? Shira Goodman sent me to find you. Thought you might want to see this. That's a frequency. What the? Where did you get? Where? Jane! You're hurt! It's nothing, Doc. Tell me the briefcase is safe. No, the truck is gone. I... Oh, motherfucker. Wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, 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 listen to me, listen to me. I might be able to stop the bleeding, but you have to tell me where your people took my truck. I will save your life. Promise? Yes. Go down past river. All right, Doc, move back. Wait, no, 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 no. I just gave this man my word. We can't leave him alive. He knows too much. No, he doesn't have to die. We already have what we want. <coughs> James! No! Oh God. oh, God. Get her up. I'm taking her back to my truck. No! You have to find the dog's truck. It's more important than me. You have no idea. There's a briefcase under the oil tank. Bring it back safe. Make me dig my own grave next. This better be worth it. Oh my god.
It's still intact. The satellite uplink. The last satellite uplink. So that's what you were looking for when you found me? Yeah. And it still works? How? The case, it's mu metal. It insulates. It, it's never been opened, so the electronics inside have been safe from the goddamn anomaly. So what does it connect to? The Flores. I thought it was all disassembled for the colonization. Mostly. But we lost contact towards the end. Half of the resources we were meant to have are still up there. They're trapped in the supply pods. Seeds, electronics, hard drives full of data, all out of reach. We could rebuild civilization with those resources, but they're useless to us unless we can find a place beyond the storms. I know it. It might sound like a dream, but for those of us that believed, it kept us going. So this is it. That's why Shira sent me to get you. She wants what's inside those pods. So what do we do now? Your frequency. I can use it to locate the source of the signal. I need to reach an antenna up high somewhere. You got one in mind? Yeah. Eagle Peaks. But, uh, not yet. I told you. Everyone who goes on the stupid mission ends up dead. The, um, anomaly. Can you explain it? Well, short answer, no. They call it an anomaly because it can't be explained. It defies all known physics. It seems to be some fundamental force of this planet's nature, electromagnetic and gravitational. But it's also a kind of weather system that obeys rules and can even be forecast. Sometimes it shines, sometimes it rains. Mostly rains. I have theories, but the scientific method depends on observation, hypothesis, experimentation, and finally, peer review. The problem is, I have no peers left. Why didn't we know about the anomaly before we landed? I mean, surely it must have shown up on the surveys. I assure you, this is not the world we were promised. Every report that came back to Earth told the same story. They had found the Garden of Eden, not some world that would be trying to kill us in every conceivable way. We would have stayed on Earth for that. So what the fuck happened? I don't know. My dad, he knew this planet backwards and forwards. He was on the science council that chose this world. Obviously, something happened during the 67 years we were asleep in hyperspace. Something changed this planet. Tell me, Dr. Zahidi. Careful. That's the very last satellite uplink on Enoch. You don't know how long it took me to find it. How did you even know to look for it? My father. I found reference to it in his notes. After we landed, he was out here looking for a signal. Long before we were. He was the first one to send expeditions. And back then, I was just a kid. You came to Enoch as a child? Hmm. Not many kids were on board the Flores. My father, being who he was, had the luxury of bringing his family. I've been wondering, is it possible there are other Outriders still in cryo? Well, it's entirely possible. Jane and I... We weren't expecting to find your team, and with insurgents closing in, we didn't have time to look for anyone else. 
I don't have to tell you how dangerous the first city is, but... I'd want to be the first to know what you find. I'm curious too. I'll go check it out. I found Skarsted. What are you talking about? He's alive? No. ECA turned him into a terrarium. Oh, come on! Skarsted? Damn it. I fought with that bastard in Baghdad and Caracas. He never gave up. He was supposed to end his tour of duty on his feet. They all were. So what did you find? No one else made it. I'm sorry, Outrider. But the fact that some made it, that your cryopods kept humming for all those years, against all odds, you should count yourself lucky. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Are you lost, old man? Are we all? What are you doing here? This place isn't safe. What do you see when you look at this shattered city? I see my own story in every street. I lived here through every crisis, every revolt and riot, till they tore it away from us. I'm afraid I missed all that. We lost Earth. Soon we'll lose this planet. We lose everything in the end. Maybe that's how it has to be. I left some things in my old hut, valuable things. I couldn't survive a minute on my own. But I'd show you where they're hidden if you would open the way. I'd just like to go home once more. Stay here. I'll handle it. What happened here? Whose graves are those? Sarah. Elodie. Michelle, it wasn't their fault. I was picked as a community leader to distribute food. I admit I kept some for ourselves, for my girls. Was I supposed to watch them starve? I traded for favors. Seemed harmless enough. I only took food. But they took everything from me. Oh. But you told me you had... Nothing of value here for me but my memories. Well, take it all. Then go, please. I'll stay here a little longer. Is that the tower? Yes, it looks like the cable car's down. You might ask those soldiers if there's a way to get them working. What the hell was that noise? How about they keep the engine warm? Cable car to the radio tower. Does it work? Not since insurgents took control. They have the car on their side. You could try saying pretty please. <laughs> Thanks, I'll pass. What about the other one? I wouldn't risk it. Goes too close to the volcano. That thing's active? I mean, it spews lava from time to time, but there's something far less natural lurking in there. Okay. What's the story with your volcano? Whatever's in there, even the insurgents keep their distance. We learned the hard way. The thing stayed below the fog, dragging them down the cliffs, spraying flames. I never saw it, just heard the screams. By the time we dragged the cable car back, there was nothing but blood and ash. So, 
Before I can use the cable car, I gotta go deal with that volcano. What, are you kidding? You got some kind of a death wish? Just tell me how to get there. Oh. Altered. I'm Captain Dunham. There's a path that'll take you further up the mountains. Altered. We're all wishing you'd been with us months ago. Now we might have a fighting chance at taking back this mountain. Just tell me how to work the cable car, Captain. I need to get my scientist up to that tower. Right. Only one small problem. The cable car we control doesn't go to the tower. It goes straight to the heart of the insurgent base. The second you land, you're gonna get swarmed. But... If you can wipe out enough of them, and take back control of the radio tower car for us, I'll send your scientist across. Sounds like a plan. Hey! I'm sorry, it doesn't feel right asking you to do this alone, but after what you pulled off with that volcano... Look, your men have it rough as it is. I can handle it. Zahidi! I'm on my way across to secure the cable car to the tower. Good. I'll gather my equipment. Hold on. I still got the small matter of taking out an entire insurgent base first. Ah, yes. Well, uh, not much I can help with there. Do try not to die. Hey, Zahidi. I've been wondering. Did no one ever try flying over the anomaly? Of course they tried. I mean... Back in the day when we had things that could fly. And they dropped like a rock when their electronics flatlined. There is no such thing as over the anomaly, or under, or around. There's just dive for cover in the mud and pray. Outrider, if your frequency really works, if that radio tower leads us to the signal, if we can contact the Flores, needless to say, this can change everything. One step at a time, Doc. Let's just get you over here in one piece. Yes. That would be nice. Hold it. The signal. That's... No, we're too far away. There's too much interference from the anomaly to coordinates. But, I have a direction. What is it? It's either in the forest or somewhere beyond. What aren't you telling me? Nobody's ever come back alive from the forest. Yeah, I figured you were gonna say something like that. Listen. You hear that? Something's under the signal. This thing. Is that what it is? Whatever it is, let's not keep it waiting. Yako, prepare the truck. We're heading towards the forest. Oh, the forest? Of course. Driving into savage, uncharted territory and breathing a fungus that liquefies your organs was on my list of things to do today. You know, if I had a fucking nickel for every time... Maybe we switch the radio off for a little while. <laughs> These powers, what I can do, none of it makes any fucking sense. 
Has anyone ever studied and altered? Tried to understand why, how? Well, opportunities for study aren't exactly lining up. You're the first to offer. Oh, I'm not offering. There is one who's known for delving into the secrets of your kind, but not gently. He's an altered, notorious for the trail of experiments he's left behind. They call him the Alchemist. Both sides stay far away, but he has a lab somewhere deep in these mountains. If you go looking, be careful. But, of course, I'd be very curious to know what you find. I'm in. Point the way. Did I ask you to wrench me from darkness? To make my soul a puppet? Like you were my god! You experimented on me like a rodent! And now you'd shove me back into darkness? No! It is you who shall be known by darkness and all who claim falsely to be gods! Ugh! The Alchemist? What did you find? No answers. Just another insane fuck who paid the price for his questions. Nope, you're just gonna make it worse. No, I got it, I got it. So, we've got problems. Insurgents have taken the quarry and the only road headed east has been mined. There's no way through unless we talk to Corrigan. He's the Grand Marshal up in Trenchtown and he is not known for being generous to strangers. Fortunately, I told that charming young lady out there that we were headed east and now- Don't tell people where we're going. Right, I wouldn't normally, but it turns out she's Corrigan's associate. She'll give us an intro if we help her drive up a package. Whoa, what kind of package? <clears throat> Try anything, girly, and your short, pathetic life is over. Oh, it ain't over till it's over, sweetheart. <laughs> you? Who are you? Shana? <laughs> I go to the end of the fucking world and you're still in my fucking face? <sighs> Go drown in your bottle, asshole. <sighs> Why am I not surprised to see you in chains again? <sighs> Kurva. That girl... Is she a friend of yours? Someone from a long time ago. Any reason she hates your gut so much? Many. That woman, who is she? Doesn't matter. Look, we drop her off as soon as we can and we'd be on our way. Okay? End of story. I have a feeling it's not. Oh, shit, man. We could really use your help. We've lost contact with her. Logging camp in the valley. My workers could have all been chewed into bloody gristle by goddamn face eaters for all I know. What the hell are you snorting? That can't be approved of around here. Approved? You kidding? They'll send us to the wreckage zone if we don't take this. It's the only thing that helps us forget we're starving. 
They say it causes cancer after a dozen years. But nobody fucking lives long enough to care. <laughs> Tell me about the logging camps. You send anyone to check on them? Of course I send people. I need that wood to fortify our trenches. Any delays cost goddamn lives! But my scouts never came back. Look, I know you're busy. You're, you're fucking altered. But could you, could you find out what happened to them? I'll give you a, a cut of the action. I'll help you this once. But don't get used to it. Okay, come on. Let's go. We... we getting new... new masters again? New masters? What happened to the old ones? I, I don't know. Uh, some men came in. Uh, Corrigans, I think. And they killed them all. But it doesn't matter, because uh, we just do as we're told. Cut wood, carry water. You, you think I care who holds the whip? Okay, fuck this. I'm the only one here. You're free to go. No, 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 no! No, what? no please let me stay. They'll send me back to fight in the trenches. Here, here, I just work. And they feed me good. Please, believe me. Okay, then. That's the, that's the kind of crazy thing about it, because if you, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you, you, you gotta, you see, where, where this guy comes in, and, and uh, Oh. Oh. I found the camp. Your uh, workers are in one piece. Oh. Oh. Seems this Corrigan had taken over. Corrigan? Shit! We're supposed to be fucking allies, man. And he steals from me. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, and, and you just killed all his men. Fucking Corrigan will crucify me now. Look, if, if you see him, you gotta tell him I have nothing to do with this. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Just give me my reward. I'm done. Let's go. Buckle up, we're moving out. Oh, Ryder. And so, you gather your flock. It's so hard to never see this place again. Hey, keep your trap shut. <sighs> Where do I find this Corrigan? The big bunker. I'll let him know you're coming. Though your kind's pretty hard to miss. So, this is Gutman's new altered. She sent you to intimidate me? Aren't you both on the same side? <laughs> Today? I just need passage through your minefield. I don't want to waste my You're time. You're a prisoner. What did you do? My fortune teller predicted victory. And my men walked into an ambush. I told you what you wanted to hear. I can't 
force, the fucking visions. I've told you Sick I'm... of your bullshit! <sighs> we fight tomorrow with no altered at our side. You've got serious issues. You have an altered right here. You will fight with his men tomorrow, yeah? Just let the girl go. I don't have time for this. Who the hell is she to you? She's like some kind of daughter to me. Oh, hold on. You, you had a daughter? Nah. Maybe more like I was schooling her mom for a couple of years and maybe her aunt. Facts are blurry. Uh, I like this arrangement very much. They want the passage east and the witch? Fine. <laughs> you would take Seth's place in battle? Wait. Seth is here? The Great Altered was last seen out in the wreckage zone, hunting one of your kind. Then I'll go find him. You do that. The assault's tomorrow at dawn. If I'm to give up my oracle, I expect to see one of you back here, or our deal is... Yeah, all... yeah. Hey. Thank you. Leave the truck again, and I'll weld you to the wheel. Well, fuck me. Jakob, Seth's dead. What? Ha, he's never been defeated. <sighs> you see, they call him Moloch. Jakob, there's another altered out here. Someone more powerful than Seth. Well, that's just fucking awesome. Today, we shall see victory! A great new altered fights at our side. Together, we shall fuck them up! Go! Move, move! You still kissing that piece of junk, Coleman? Hey, at least it's better than kissing the sergeant's ass. <sighs> Give me that. What is that anyway? That's from the old world. Oh, you wouldn't understand. You can't even fucking read. I'm sorry, Grandma. It's not a fucking library. Towards... Hey! My grandma was a general. Shut the fuck up, man. You didn't know your grandma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! Do you see that? <laughs> Moloch. A new altered. You've come to finish what Seth failed to do? My fight's not with you! Oh, it is now. You fight with them. That means you die with them. down and what will be left without us that's how you think a girl for saving your life I knew my fortune teller was gold she saw exactly where you were buried I'm done, you said. A deal's a deal. 
You're free to go. Your shit prophecies can be someone else's problem. The assault. Tell me this pounding headache was worth it. <laughs> the news is good. Of course, it was a bloodbath. But while you were entertaining that abomination, we took back the front. Are you sure I can't entice you to stay? Life is good around here for the altered. The glory of battle. Women, men, worshippers at your feet. Thanks. There's somewhere I gotta be. East? The quarry's overrun. Past that's the edge of the world. What does Gutman have you looking for? Passage through the minefield. That was our deal. Marshal Bailey knows the way. She'll see your convoy through. What? No fucking way! Guide us over radio, draw a map. We are not taking her. We? I never said you were coming. <laughs> I'd say you always had a home here altered. But I don't think you'll be coming back alive. Would you piss off? I don't need anyone else to babysit. I can take care of myself. Not where we're going. Hey, just wait! It ain't over till it's over. Jana! Did what you was just... that? It's how I know I'm supposed to go with you. The anomaly fucked me up too. But I only get the visions. Always horrible visions all my life. Except one. One that's beautiful. It's this planet. But it's lush. And it's green. It's, it's in the future. And there's always someone there with me. I could never see the face, but the voice. It's you. Whatever it is you're doing, I know it's gonna work. Because in the end, we're in that meadow together. So you see the future. You can tell me when to dodge a bullet. <laughs> I wish. Ah, uh, that's not how it works. I just get flashes. I don't control it, it just happens. And half the time I read it wrong. But Corgan was crazy about you. <sighs> I get it right just often enough. Where did these visions come from? The anomaly that killed my mom. I ripped through a hut in the middle of the night. Decided to spare me. It just fucked with my head. I'm sorry. The bad, violent, awful shit. And that's all I ever see. I was a kid when it happened. <laughs> I used to think I was going insane. But when you figure out you weren't... <laughs> I'm still not so sure. These visions... How do you know they're real? How do you know yours are real? I don't see the future, just shitty things that have already happened, except once, actually. The first time it happened, I... I saw you. Well, there you go. Oh, hell no! I'm not going anywhere with that bitch. Jana can't come with us. That wasn't the deal. In the truck, both of you. Jana, what do you think you're doing? Jana! Jana, listen to me for once. Where I am taking these two, there's no coming back. I didn't save your life again to watch you throw it all away. That's what you're telling yourself now? You're my savior? 
pathetic. Fine. Next time you're in trouble, I won't think twice. I'll let you die, you stupid cow. Well, you gotta die somewhere. And if it's out there, at least I get to watch you go first. John. So long, fuckers. You're heading back across the minefield on foot? Better than where you're headed. Have fun getting yourselves killed. That's it. The quarry. I've got a plan to get us through alive. We have to make some modifications to the truck. You're not touching the truck. We have to seal the interior. Then with lithium perchlorate to generate oxygen and iron powder and lithium hydroxide to scrub CO2. English, please. The truck will be like a bubble. And we'll be safe inside so long as we have lithium to generate oxygen. That'll give us time to find the source of the signal. Would you expect me to magically pour more lithium out of my ass when our supply runs out? I can do without the snide remarks. The only source of lithium on Enoch comes from old batteries from Earth. Now, most of them were scavenged for parts long ago, but the mining operation's been inaccessible for years. There's bound to still be some of them around here. Simply put, we find the batteries, we get to live. Oh, better and better. Let's move. Thank you. I, I don't think that... Uh... You just got real lucky, old man. <clears throat> what if she comes with us? If we make it through, someone has to keep the briefcase and me safe when you're not around. Look, old man, I don't do charity work. No, no, please, we need you. Give me a break. She's playing us. This is her way of weaseling her way into our troop. She's spying for Corrigan. You see that in your crystal ball? Admit it, you psychopath. You know I'm right. You couldn't pay me enough of whatever prize you're after, freak. We're tracking a signal that's coming from beyond the anomaly. When we find it, we're gonna reconnect to the Flores and bring down those lost supply pods. Keep Dr. Zahidi alive and keep your stupid mouth shut and you'll get your share of the loot. Deal? Fucking believable. I know, I know, she's a pain in the ass. But, uh, well, if you lay a hand on her ever again, I'll run you over with this goddamn truck. Jakob, you came here under orders. You don't have to go any further. Who's gonna keep this Dupec truck running, if not me? Don't worry, I know a thing or two. You! You remember nothing I taught you. What are you even going on the suicide mission for anyway? Because I believe there's a better world out there somewhere. Pfft. Doesn't matter where we go. We'll still be there to fuck it up. Yeah. Well, with that attitude... <sighs> we got one shot at this. But let's be honest. Anyone who follows me out there today is probably gonna die. And we'll all be home for Christmas. How do I keep getting myself into this shit?
Watch out! We need to fix the purifier! What's the point, huh? The truck is fucked! Worry about that later. Let's reseal the door! Don't go out there! Just wait for me. Doesn't in this way. It can't. <laughs> Is that what your magic fucking fairy vision said? Because it sure as hell doesn't look like we're getting out of here. And what? No, 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 no. It's okay. Something happens. Who the hell are you? <coughs> hey, <coughs> where are you taking us? Who the hell are you people? All your questions will be answered when we reach Dr. Skurlock. <coughs> it's too late. We're not making it to any doctor. Stand down, or your people will die! You'll fucking die with them! I'm not threatening them, asshole! I'm trying to save them! The hell? What exactly is in this? Please, please, uh, do, do not fear. My name is Nathan Skurlock, xenobiologist. Uh, Dr. Abraham Zahidi, can you explain to Zahidi. us Zahidi? Oh my, what an unexpected honor. I was a follower of your father's work, um, at least um, as long as was possible. I haven't uh, so much claim to fame. But as you can see, there is one breakthrough of mine that has served us rather well. Just tell us how it works. Um, yes, yes, of course. My apologies. Um, the fungus wasn't always like this. Its DNA was altered. My formula merely turns the fungus against itself. Here, all who are brave enough to reach us are free to live in peace. My antidote must be injected daily. None of us dare stray far away from camp without it. We have a small ceremony each month. We're just in time for one. No alters, I'm afraid. I hope that the rest of your convoy will attend this evening. We're not planning on staying long. Oh, beyond here, there's only death. Until the truck is repaired, we're stuck here anyway. Oh, good. Thank you. Mm. Jakob. Mm. Look what I found in the forest. This was Cuthbert's. We've been here before. Well, shit. I thought things looked familiar. But I thought it was Skurlock's drugs. But unless you can pull a spare oil pump from your ass, we're not going very far. We left a truck here before. That day the first storm hit. Maybe I can find it. Find it? That was 30 years ago. Not for me. Screw till they push back, then loosen a little. You, you forget everything I taught you. Taught me? You think you taught me anything, old man? Unbelievable. <laughs> Feisty. She definitely got her temper from you. Looks like we're taking a break. I guess you've earned the right to hear the full story. So, uh, a long time ago, before this shitty planet, before we even left Earth, I was flying workers to the Caravel Orbit Station. Uh, the flames started to surround me, and I tried to find an exit. And that's when I tripped, and I saw this damn pregnant woman lying under the rubble.
I was able to save both of us. Well, three. Hold on. You were there during the Caravel disaster? Other survivors of the Caravel were given a free ticket aboard the brand new Flores, and I met her again. <laughs> right here, in Trench Town. Her child was born. It was a girl. And she named her Chana. Then that little brand was only six when she saw her mother killed right in front of her. So you raised her? Go on. The truck isn't going to fix itself. I'm sure it wasn't easy, growing up with Jakob around, trying to be a dad. Believe me, he was the least of it. Being a kid in this fucking war? I've heard stories. I can imagine. <laughs> no, you can't. You know, you don't look much older than me, but I heard you got to magically jump over the past couple of decades. <laughs> Honestly, you've got no idea what it was like growing up in this non-stop bloodbath. Hey, you have any idea what it's like watching your whole fucking planet die? <sighs> no, shit. I'm sorry. You must have lost people. Yeah. Yeah. We all did. Few make it out this far alive. Even less mean to keep going. What is it you're looking for, friend? I'm not your friend. You don't know what's out there. There are things I could tell you. Things I could warn you about, but you would not believe these things. And what makes you so sure? Because the things I've seen, even I do not believe them. That was Skurlock's little ceremony? How was it? It was weird. A bunch of rambling speeches about brotherhood. We all picked stones from a basket. And hey, there was music and free drugs, so not all bad. Where's Zahidi? Went off with Skurlock talking some science mumbo-jumbo. Well, he'll be back. No, he won't. Mm -hmm. Your friend picked the black stone. What are you talking about? They're taking him to the facility. Get me out of here. I'll lead you. Skurlock makes his antidote here. Very few know what goes on inside. And how do you? I used to help him make it. Until he took a friend of mine prisoner. Stop! Hey, how you doing? I'd like to see Dr. Zahidi, please. This facility is off limits! You will not get a second warning! People. That's what they injected us with. He needed bone marrow for the antidote to work. All those people who escaped the war came here to die instead. And I was next. You think that was easy for me, Doctor? It's random. It has to be. 
Except for you. Save from your own lottery, I suppose. How convenient. I create the antidote. I keep us alive. How many exactly have you sacrificed for your little utopia? I am not a monster. I carry the burden. A few must be sacrificed so many can live. What are you going to choose who lives and dies? I don't hide behind a basket of stones. When I kill a man, he knows it was me. No. Take as much as you can carry. You didn't have to kill him. He was a man of science. There's so few of us left. He was a self-righteous murderer. And what does that make me then? His antidote, God help me, we're still gonna use it. You haven't yet seen anything. Oh my god. Is that a native of Enoch? I found August out there. Lost and alone. I tried to give shelter. But Skurlock only saw a specimen to experiment on. This... This changes everything. Please! No more! He can talk? No more Skurlock, please. August, it's alright. They're not like the others, they're friends. Friend? Tiago. <laughs> Okay, you're free now. Go home. They got Skurlock! Alert tag! Get Dr. Zahidi back to my truck. We move out, right away, east. There's a ravine to the east. You'll have to go south around it. You know this forest? I've gone further than anyone else. I'm not a deserter. I came into this forest because I'm an explorer. A voyager. Like you, Outrider. We're heading beyond the anomaly. Don't know if we'll be coming back, but... We could use a guide. It's become a regular clown car. My god. We'll have to report this to Gutman. Can't believe we've been next to an alien civilization all these years. In this case, aren't we the aliens? These ruins are ancient. If beings like the ones we saw sent the signal, it wasn't from here. Are you sure we're still heading in the right direction? Honestly, Outrider, I don't know. But... If you can get a receiver above this tree line, we should be close enough to pick up the trail again. I know of a structure. Give me a radio, I can guide you. Interesting friend you made. How'd that happen? Fate, perhaps. I stumbled upon August while exploring the forest. Lost and alone. Yet with eyes that could see my soul. August ran at first, but got cornered by a beast. I was there as a savior. As if preordained. August wasn't so afraid of me after that. Are there others? August is the only one I've seen. We taught each other the little we could of language. 
But Skurlock didn't take long to find us. I gotta know. August is a... he? Or a she? <laughs> I'm not sure myself. Hmm. Shanna's visions. Are they real? Her and her fucking visions. You know, I have visions all the time, too. I have visions of whores sucking my Long John Silver. But it never happens. direction but there's a big storm brewing warn the others we need to find shelter August, you came back! What exactly is your friend doing? Bailey! <laughs> Fuck! Look at this fucking thing! It's making the fucking storm! No, wait! It's not what you think! August can channel it! Control it! Look, August is helping us! No shit! Bailey, you need to stand down. No, I don't think so. Think maybe I've gone far enough on your little death march. Think I'm going back to Corrigan and taking this freak with me. Come here. what it feels like. Bailey, be careful. You don't know what this energy could do to you. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> Go. Go! Really? You don't want to do this. <sighs> you could not be more wrong, freak. Don't win this! No! Why is it going away? No! No, wait! Wait! No! 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 She's breathing, but her spinal cord's most likely severed if she survives. She'll never walk again. Good. She can watch the monsters eat her liver. Let's go. No reason to leave her to suffer. No! I, I, I don't care what she's done. We need to bring her. I, I will take care of her personally. I, I would do the same for any of you. Really? Okay, now the no bullshit version. My vision of the meadow, I've been seeing more of it. Bailey's in it. How's it supposed to come true if she's not with us? 
in your vision. Is everyone there? How? I don't know. Have you told him? He doesn't listen to anything I say. <laughs> Any theories on what August did in that temple? Uh, still formulating. But even if I had one, there's no way I could replicate. Wait, wait, wait. Don't look at me. I got nothing. Not true. You're more like August than you are like any of us. Your powers, they may manifest in more violent ways, but there's no doubt you have a certain uh, uh, control over the anomaly. You're thinking I can turn on that big obelisk thing like August well, did? Well, no, but whatever Bailey did seems to have damaged it, but there must be more obelisks out there in the ruins. Perhaps you could find them. I'll try, but no promises. What happened? It lit up, and I got blasted. Whoa, so there was a reaction? Yeah, but not the good kind. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Zahidi, it's one of those giants. I don't know if I just woke him out of a snooze, or... Somehow, maybe the energy flash drew him. Incredible. Of course, there must be some kind of connection between the anomaly and the fauna of Enoch. It must be inside all of them. Zahidi! Are you seeing this? Everyone is. Whatever you're doing, stop. Did that light show help your theories? I'm not sure. What we saw seems to indicate that the anomaly originates from deep within Enoch. Mm -hmm. These obelisks must be some sort of uh, conduits uh, containing the energy. Or releasing it. But how, I don't know. Wish my father had been here to see this. Somehow I know he'd have an answer. Hold up! Movement in the trees behind us, it's Kang! Probably wants his revenge. Ah, uh, he can get in line. You ever seen anything like it? I can't say I have. What do you think it is? Well, clearly it's built from physical materials, but emanating an energy of some alien origin, I can't quite find the words to explain maybe we're not supposed to explain it understand it that energy coming off of it i mean don't you feel it it's like a buzz in my whole body that buzz has a perfectly reasonable rational seriously stop trying to rationalize it just feel it Well, I... <laughs> that was weird. What? Don't look at me. She's a mystic. Jakob. What's your take on that, uh... Alien? <clears throat> the bug-eyed fruit loop over there? Knows nothing. Watch this. Hey! Okay. 
You want a drink? It's vodka. Vodka puts hair on your chest. Hey, whoa there, careful. Why you people come here? We came because our world died. Didn't have anywhere else to go. You always kill your world? Pretty much. Crazy fucking thing, eh? You lost? Just passing through. That'll get you killed around here. This place is hell. Yeah, one's hell's another paradise. It's a strange feeling serving a higher purpose. One has a sense of dread. But also, a profound sense of having been chosen. Who are you? And what are you doing out here? If one wants to understand this world, there's a place we must reach. But there are too many beasts. And my powers fail me. The monolith of the old ones. I, uh... I need your help. You will be compensated. When you put it that way, sure I'll help. <sighs> You're altered. Is that what they call it, where you come from? Where the hell do you come from? And why did you ask for my help? You have powers, you could have just- Be wary of your powers. Altered. It will lead you to madness. The more you feed them, the harder the darkness pulls. <sighs> I no longer have the strength. Ah. Uh, yes. Perhaps. Ah. Uh, yes. You can read that? Who are you? Go back the way you came if I were you. The way forward is only death. Compensation for your troubles. Everything we've been hoping for is right behind this gate, but there's no obvious mechanism for opening it. Argus, you must know, yes? Lost people. You mean there's others like you? Maybe. What do you mean? You know what's out there? Oh, come on! That's our only hope? It's the end of the goddamn world out there. What happened to a place beyond the storms, huh? We are about to go farther than any man has ever gone before. Let's go, before I change my fucking mind. Mr. Spock. Crazy Vulcan bullshit. Look. 
Look at the size of that storm. It's coming fast. We need shelter. I'll take the lead. Stay on me. Well, this just gets better and better. Looks like we may be here a while. Drink, you stupid bitch. Mm. Hey, hey, she's waking up! Hey, hey. How do you feel? You've been out a few days. Whoa, 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 whoa. I... I can't... I can't, I can't feel my legs. I'm sorry, Bailey. Why didn't you just kill me? Dada. My masterpiece. The Braski has outdone himself again. What? What did I do now? Oh. I thought my daughter wanted you to live. For God knows what reason. Kill me? Or get out of my face? Shana! Is that a fire out there? It seems we're not alone. Warn the others. I'll go check it out. The fuck. Rohan Gratwick. <sighs> what the hell? Jakob, the light was an ambush. Some real uglies that were drawing me out. Do you copy? Jakob! Oh my god! What the what fuck? fuck? Get me out of here! August! Us do nothing! Us hide! Now friends! Taken! Taken? Yes! They took them? Yes! Alive? Yes. For. to eat them. Us no us take you. All right. August, wait. Take this. Us cannot. Or else like them. Stay in the truck. I'll find them. What the fuck? Hey! <sighs> they took Chana to the fire pits. Ah! 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 Ah!
causing me trouble, do you? out of here. Now! Let's dance, motherfucker. You know, I always thought the old cockroach could survive anything. My mom always told me he was the only outrider on Enoch, still alive. He even escaped the wreck of the caravel back when the Earth was dying, she said. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> but why him? You know? What was his magic charm? <sighs> I always thought it was just not giving a shit about any of it, like it protected him. Well, uh, I guess he finally gave a shit about something. <laughs> well, well. Can you believe it? Turns out the old man's chair on wheels is, uh, really practical. <laughs> it's only gonna get worse the further we go. If anybody wants to go back, do it now. But I got one mission. I'm finding that signal. You're gonna need a driver. I'm sensing some, uh, tension between you and Chana. Well, how fucking perceptive. And you get visions like the fortune teller? Just what we need. More freaks for the freak show. Look. I was born and raised in Trench Town. Fought my way up every rung of the ladder. And that bitch, half of what she sees is bullshit. But still, Corrigan gets a hard-on for magic mutants, and so he sends me after her. It's bullshit. All I wanted was to be strong. And now... It's like a bad dream. Come on. You're still alive. <laughs> so? Tell me, what's the point? I got no idea, but at least it's something. Chana's vision, you're in it. She's really got you believing in that shit, hasn't she? It doesn't matter what I believe. Whether you like it or not, you reach the end. And it's not from anybody carrying you. Zahidi, I found some ancient carvings. Seems like it might be... Some kind of hieroglyphics from August's people. Incredible. Can you make anything out? Not really my area of expertise. Well, perhaps you can find more carvings around the village. If there are any you could decipher, we might learn something about their history. There's, like, something crazy dangerous coming from the sky. Oh, the anomaly, probably. Looks like many died. They hid in... caves, maybe? Hmm. But then how could August's people have survived to build villages like this? Beats me. 
This is an incredible find. Keep looking, Outrider. It looks like the anomaly again, but I think they brought some kind of control to it. Defended themselves from it. How? Maybe the obelisks, like in the forest. But this shows a group of them working together, I think. It can't have been easy to do. Could be why August collapsed back in the forest, trying to protect us from that storm all alone. See if you can find any more carvings. It actually looks like a time when there was no anomaly storms, when the Pax prospered, when there was balance on Enoch. You think they did it? They stopped the anomaly? Or is it just showing the time before? Either way, they clearly only kept the anomaly at bay for a while, until it wiped them all out. Just like it'll wipe us out if we fail and there will be no one left to read our history. What the fuck? <laughs> These are our trucks, but none of our expeditions made it out of the forest alive. How is this even possible? If they came from the forest, they're going the wrong way. No. Look closer. This isn't us. The enemy, then? Oh my god. Is that some kind of fuel cell? I've never seen tech this advanced before. Who the hell were they? Whoever they were... They lost. This was a massacre. We can't stay here. Chana. We need to find shelter. We head for those rocks. I didn't think we'd make it out of that storm. That's no storm. Look! There's someone out there. Wait, isn't that the son of a bitch that killed Jakob? Man, you're really good at pissing people off. This fuck's not letting this go. Neither am I. Next time I see him, he's dead. Up here, I found something. <laughs> Some kind of outpost. Looks human. You see that antenna over there? I can use it to trace the signal. You hear that? It's a digital relay device. The hell's it supposed to be relaying? Our signal? Our signal was then? But how is it playing when I landed? How is that even possible? It's not. It's not possible. Only one interstellar ship ever left Earth. Ours. Then who were they? Doesn't matter. Those coordinates. We find them, we plug in, and we contact the damn Flores. Amazing. August, your people made this? How? Who cares? No other way but through. Need to keep moving.
August. What happened here? Incoming! Get out of there! Now! Oh, shit. Hide! In there! Go! August, get behind me. Giant cockroaches! I'm right here! Happened to August. August's people weren't wiped out by savages. They became savages. But why would they do that? <laughs> you again. Huh. Seems we're searching for the same thing, but for different reasons. There's another monolith I need to examine over yonder, but the danger is too great. You can't handle these creatures? I really find that hard to believe. I don't fear the creatures. I... I fear what I would do to them. What I would unleash. But the monolith holds secrets. Perhaps there is a way back. Could you aid me in reaching it? You will be compensated. Count me in. Stand back. I can't foresee the reaction. What reaction? <sighs> Are you insane? <laughs> I was. 
Yes. Finally. I know what I need to do. Your compensation. We're so close. The signal's coming from just beyond this ridge. Stay on the lookout. You see any movement, run. You. I've been waiting for you. Did you know about all this? What Monroy's people did here? I... I was a part of it. Tell me, Altered. Do you believe in absolution? That depends on who's doing the absolving. He breathes. What are you doing? <sighs> no. What you want to know is who I am. I... I was the second in command in Monroy's army. I did everything he commanded. I studied the Pax. I learned their language. I knew my enemy. And then I exterminated them. Men. Women. Children. All for the human project. To seize their powers. And turn us into gods! <sighs> Nothing seems foul when you win. But when we began to lose, my regrets grew. <clears throat> Until I chose exile, and wandered the desert seeking death. Instead, I was afflicted with this condition, ripped apart by a storm, uh, and cursed with the very power we tried to steal. I was the first of us, but now I've finally found a way to make things right and bring back the children of Enoch. How? Uh, uh, Enoch is ripping through me! I don't have... Uh, I don't have much time left! Will you help me? Uh, keep the creatures at bay until I'm ready! You're fucking crazy! Make it quick! The Pax will walk Enoch once more. Change. Please! Enough! What's done is done. There is no absolution. You either live with it or you don't. No. There must be a way. I will see you again, I fear. Another time. Another place. This Monroy was a madman. Hey, there's a ship! Is that... the Caravel? That's not possible. Caravel never left Earth. Its engines exploded. Tens of thousands died. Then what the hell are we looking at? The source of the fucking signal. Monroy's signal. There's no place beyond the storm. It's coming from in there, protected from the anomaly, just like the uplink in your goddamn briefcase. I don't fucking understand. Neither do I. It doesn't make any sense. Everyone saw the caravel explode during its construction. 
Even if the people left on Earth were able to rebuild the ship, they left after us. We were the first. Nevertheless, what's certain is that Monroy enslaved August's people. He butchered them, and they turned. They mutated into savages willingly, so they could fight back. I'm done with all this. Whatever's waiting for you on that ship, I want no part of it. Tiago, you can't leave us now. I thought you weren't a deserter. What they did to August's people. What our people did to August, don't you see? Thank you for letting me walk away with you. We're going to finish this. We're finding a way into the caravel. Signal. We're here. It works. Oh God, it works. Someone hit the lights. Look, it's exactly as I saw it. It is we saw it. Jana, that's not real. That's this planet, all right, but it's long gone. No. No, it's... Get the fuck off! It's... Today. You okay? Oh. You, you're here. I, I, I imagined this so many times. But never you. Who are you? Who am I? <laughs> Minroy? But how? How did you, how did this ship get here before us? How do you think? You people left us to die as the earth crumbled. But I don't die so easy, do I? No, we built a, a new engine. An engine that, that chained all others before it. So while you were still crawling through deep space, we were already here. Oh, you should have seen it. Their primitive civilization, the natives, they treated us like gods. Yeah. I've seen what you did to the natives. Oh, oh. I see now. This isn't a rescue. Why didn't you come when we sent out the distress call? Huh? It's 30 years since the Flores arrived in our skies. 30 years surviving in this hell. This hell was because of you. My entire life trapped in that valley, slaughtering each other for nothing. You robbed our people of hope before we even got here. Now don't flatter yourselves. You were as capable of every wickedness. The Pax weren't as docile as they looked. They had powers. So much power. Things I had to understand. So you just rounded them up? You tortured them, you son of a bitch. Are you really so naive? How long before those creatures tired of us? Before they turned against us? They would have 
had us on our bloody knees. All that I wanted was their powers for us, for all of us, so that we could survive, so we could be strong. Don't you see? We lost the Earth because we were meant for something more. There. But for the grace of I go you, my child. Do you think that you would be standing there with the powers of a god if it hadn't been for me? All that I've done for humanity. I saved us. You cursed us. But I won. It's done. Fuck him. No more wasting time. I have to tap the uplink into the Caravel's power so we can reach the Flores before we... They found us. We gotta go. No, no, leave me. I have to do this. Do what you gotta do, Doc. That door won't hold long. Outrider, if that beast cracks this ship's hull, we lose electronics, we lose the pods, we lose everything. I'll take care of it. You just get those pods down. in there it's working I've contacted the Flores transmitting the first launch codes now god damn it doc we can't hold them <laughs> this place is gonna blow almost there almost there signal, the uplink, it was all for nothing. Wait, guys, look, over there. The pods, it, it works? You did it. My God. I guess some of the commands went through after all. Well, like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. <laughs> what the hell? Monroe's people? No, I don't think so. Who are you? We're from the war zone. Are you the Outriders? We heard tales 
About an altered? Outriders. Opening the frontier. Finding a cure in the forest. We've... been following your trail since the war zone. So, what now? We keep moving. Did it. The fuckers did it. <laughs>